Hey, good day, everybody. It's Monday, the 14th, Valentine's Day. Um, and again, for today's record, I'm just gonna, this is gonna go back to 1969 and an album that had a big impact on me in terms of guitar players. I don't even know where I heard this first and I don't even know when I bought it, but I know I saw Leo Kotke uh, sometime in the 73 time frame at Berkeley Community Theater. Um, he's at that time, in his prime, an absolutely amazing guitar player, acoustic guitar player, both uh, 12 string and six string. Um, this record here was his first studio release, again, recorded in 1969, apparently recorded in like a six hour setting or something like that uh, in one day. Many of the cuts on this were one take. Uh, I will put some in, links in the down below here uh, so you can get a feel for what this guy was all about. Uh, I, I found a video that you know I put up here above that gives you a little bit of a taste of, of how amazing this guy is as a guitar player. Unfortunately, he had some problems. The way he played, as aggressive as he was, he ended up with tendonitis, and he had to overcome that. He actually had to change his style a little bit. So videos of him later, you know, in, in you know more recent videos, uh, he's nowhere near what he was in, uh, in the early 70s. Just an amazing, amazing guitar player. This album is all acoustics. In fact, on the liner notes on the back, it even says, it says that Leo, he says, uh, finally considering Kotke's voice, which sounds like geese farts on a muggy day, all that is left to be said is that Kotke's voice does not appear on this album. His guitar does. Check it out. I'll talk to you again tomorrow. Bye.